You know the phrase, work smarter, not harder? Well, be prepared to be a genius with this creamy balsamic vinaigrette. Okay, I don't know if this is gonna raise your IQ, but it's definitely gonna save you a lot of time in the kitchen. I find myself constantly reaching for it, and it's really, really easy to put together. So we need, of course, balsamic vinegar. We need some extra virgin olive oil. We've got some Dijon mustard. Get in there. Hang on. Yeah. We've got some pepper, of course, meat and salt. We have our mayo to make it creamy. Sweeten it up with a little bit of honey. You could use as much or as little as you like. I like a quarter cup. So I'm gonna go one, two, three, four tablespoons. And garlic. Now, four or five of these cubes, depending on how much garlic you like. Now, I like a lot of garlic, so if you think you like garlic, don't do 10, five, stick with five. Just pop them right in here. Add the lid and give it a shake. That's it, that's the entire recipe, but don't let its simplicity fool you because this is a workhorse of a sauce. I find myself constantly reaching for it. It is amazing on grilled chicken, um, white or dark meat, up to you. It is delicious drizzled over grilled vegetables. It is amazing, obviously, as a salad dressing. You probably brush it over salmon. Um, you could drink it with a straw. You could use it as a moisturizer. Like, I haven't found a use for this yet that wasn't absolutely incredible. So we're just gonna pour some onto some chicken cutlets. Give them a quick mix. And the longer this marinates, obviously the more pronounced the flavor is, but if you're pressed for time, you can grill these right away. If you're one of those people who likes to plan ahead and like meal prep, you can actually prep a lot of this and keep it in zip top bags in the freezer and it'll have an even more pronounced flavor because it'll sit in that marinade as it freezes and as it defrosts. All right, that's it. You just wanna make sure it's coated on all sides and off to the off to the grill we go. Okay, I've got my grilled chicken here. Now let's build a salad. By the way, oh my God, you know what would be so good? On portobello mushrooms. Did I say that? You should do that. That sounds really delicious. Um, but this could also be obviously built into a wrap on like a rice bowl. Like do anything you want with it. It's so, so good. We're gonna slice up our chicken. Hope you enjoy this as much as I do. Cheers. We're ready? Yeah, good, great, yeah. <laughs> what am I saying? I'm gonna do that one more time. What am I saying? One more time. Imagine you see me going out there. What am I saying? Okay. Huh? <laughs> Sure. Yeah? Yeah? Yes, I should. <laughs> doors. Stand clear of the closing doors. Stand clear of the closing doors, please. Join us next time for an adorable addition to your Rosh Hashanah table.